to have that. That's better. Yeah. I can just move. A couple of nodes there now, Henry. And uh, welcome to the uh, site of the 2012 instructor race at uh, Northridge. It's going to be quite quite a race. There's uh, some some highly competitive uh, athletes going out today, and they're they're certainly getting their boats ready for the action. It's going to be it's going to be quite something. Don't miss it. Come down here. Okay, we're here today for the Northbridge Sailing Club Instructors Race. There's some high-tech preparation going on and Jack Breeslin is certainly partaking in, in, in such activities. Uh, we're, we're here with Jack right right here and uh, he's going he's gonna to show us around his uh, weapon of choice. Uh, well, this is a homebrew. It's uh, built by the brewers. Main sheet, obviously. Um, comes in handy. I've just adjusted the uh, sail ties. For the, uh, the conditions at the moment, but we can change that on the water if we have to. Great, great boats. So uh, last time I sailed one was this time last year, but um, well, I'm a bit of a natural, so it, it doesn't phase me too much. Airbags, obviously, uh, not too important for me. I don't really get much water in. I usually take the uh, baler and the paddle out as well. So. Uh, Having, having spent so long out of the boat, uh, how do you prepare for, for a race like this? Um, well, I think most of it is a, is a it's mental. Um, confidence is a big part of it, which is good for me. Yeah, yeah, I've heard a lot of people saying that uh, when you spend a lot of time out of the boat, that visual, visualisation is a good technique to use uh, uh, just to get your mind back into the game and back into sailing an Optimus. Yeah, well, I've... Um, I've been watching OptiWorld's videos, um, DVDs over the last few days. It's, they're, they're quite simple to sail, it's like riding a bike, you know. Just keep the boat handling, keep it simple, um, and just, yeah, just focus on the simple things. I think it'll get you around the track. From one previous winner of this race to another, how, how do you prepare for a race with such prestige? And uh, and, and being being the reigning champion, there must be a bit of uh, expectation there. Yeah, well, uh, obviously I am the, uh, the favourite, um, but I've sort of come to accept that in, in most of my sailing. Um, I like to take it on board and I like, I like the, uh, I, I quite like the pressure. I think I perform, perform best um, when I'm being pushed. Although, <laughs> I'm not sure how pushed I'll be today, but um, you know, it's just, it's just something, another thing you have to take on board, you know, and you can't worry about it once you're on the water. You've just got to do your thing. Well, absolutely. Uh, good luck for the race. Thanks, off. I'll see you at the finish line. I'm here with Alex Sidden and he's, he's going to show us around uh, around his boat. Uh, Who did you get this boat from? I want to hit you. I don't know. Uh, quite a nice little girl in that group actually. Yeah. I picked it because of the uh, that boat right here. Nice. Pretty happy with that. Going for the going for the retro look. Then. Oh, that retro always wins. Retro always comes back. Retro is fast. Retro is fast. So how watch. have you how have you changed the setup at all? You, uh, Max tells me I've done an illegal thing and it leaks and off a bit too much. So I uh, have to change that. Maybe not. We'll see about that. Right. Well, we've got it, we've got it on camera now, so there's uh, evidence of that. That's right. I'm gonna change it. That can oh. be checked after the race. Okay. I don't know if that's legal. Right, Graham. Yeah. Uh, is that legal? Oh, definitely. Oh, there you go. Uh, you get way well, too much um, stuff in there. Excuse me, could you not hijack my interview? Oh, let me in. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, what do you think about the conditions? Are they going to favour you in, in any way? Uh, we'll see. You know, today's the, uh, been the most breeze of the week yeah. ever in the instructor race too. You know, me and Jack have been uh, battling it out, or the two Jacks have been battling it out for the past couple of years. So, you know, maybe you might come back 
So, so what do you think about the prospect at joining a list with such names as Jack Griezmann, Jack Dawson, Henry Turner, Hugh Tate? Uh, you know, there's quite a prestigious list of names there. What, what, what would it be like to join that list? The most amazing thing in the world, you know. Yeah. Oh, it's better than winning, you know, world championships, softies. And to see, got to win the trucks first. That's all that matters. Absolutely. All that matters. Well, from one past champion to another, good luck today, and uh, Thank you, sir. I, I hope you do well. Thank you. Okay, we're we're here with uh, Kia Hodgkinson. I'd have to say she's one of the top favourites for this race this afternoon, and she's she's chosen boat five seven four. Why don't you tell us about the boat, Kia? Well, it was originally sailed by Max Richardson and now currently by Allegra Richardson. And it went up to nationals this year, I'm pretty sure. Um, how do you feel about the conditions on the, on the water today? Well, I was hoping it, for it to be a little bit lighter, seeing as I am one of the lighter crews. How do you feel to be racing against past champions like, like Jack Breesland and, and JD? And, uh, <laughs> And, and how, how, does that, how does that compare to other sailing you've done? Well, I am in fact the only instructor who has ever raced Ofties as a fleet. <laughs> so... Okay. Yeah. Right, right, so that, that takes, you know, you've got a bit of experience coming, coming into this race and, uh, and you, must, you must take some confidence out of that, Kat. Oh yeah, definitely. So I'm keen to see how it goes. It should be a good race. Well, good luck for the race, Kev. Thank you. Why, what are you not sailing? Opti. Why? Because I don't like them. They're like, she's not a cool. loser. They're like bathtubs, and they have these she's weird sails, and they sail weird. No, a loser. Not she's awesome. I'm a loser. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, she's second row. She, she could still make it to the start line, but she's going to have to get moving from here on in. Jack Friesland looking for the, the four-tack start. will be one to watch. There's a big gap on this boat end. Sam Holmes is looking to take advantage of it. We're coming up with, with 15 seconds to go now. This is it. This is it, folks. The start of the instructor's race at Northridge in 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And they're off. Clear start. Clear start. Kia's done a good job. And Jack, however, is first start and back wide.
from one previous winner of this race to another, how, how do you prepare for the the mental stress and and expectation that that holds? You know, coming in as as the reigning champion and trying to defend your title. Yeah, well, um, obviously I am the favourite. Um, I've, I've come to accept that. Um, you know. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm stoked that you can't say that with a straight face no, 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 because I'd be worried I'll get you out. Get out. <laughs> 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 you cocky bastard. <laughs> <laughs> I've just been talking to him. Okay, ask the question again.